Today I'm making Jamaican roast jerk fish. This is one of the most delicious and simple way to cook fish. See step by step instruction and information how to do roast fish the Jamaican way. Today I am at the Spanish Town Fishing Village which is located in Pickenham Park, Spanish Town St. Catherine in the Sunshine Island of Jamaica. I'm here to buy a couple pounds of red snapper to make my roast fish on the grill. This location is where you get red snapper, live red snapper. By the pound, by the bucket, whatever amount. This is the right location. So I will purchase a couple of pounds of red snapper and get them scale and prepare and clean to do my red snapper on the grill. To make your roast fish, you can use any fish of your choice. This is the fish I'm using to do my roast fish. You will also need some dry rub. So I will use all purpose seasoning, black pepper, salt and fish seasoning to make a mix, a dry rub mix. I will also use butter. You can use any butter of your choice. I will also stuff my fish with color low. So see my video with how to cook color low for that. I will also using file paper to wrap my fish. This is how the process goes. First, you will rub your fish with the dry rub. This is to add flavor to the fish. Very simple and easy. So just rub dry for some dry rub outside of the fish, inside of the fish. Secondly, you will apply some butter to the file paper. Then you will put that color of okra stuffing inside the fish. Then put on file paper, roll tightly and properly for no leaking to trap the steam and eat to cook your fish. You will repeat this process based on the amount of fish you are doing. So just relax and properly rub your dry rub on your fish. Put the stuffing inside, put butter on the file paper, wrap your fish. However, if you are doing a lot of fish, a couple of fish, it is easier if you get some lending on to make the process easy. Okay, you can see here we have three person doing this preparation. One person rub the dry rub on the fish. The next person put the colorless stuff in and the next person wrap. However, this job can be done by one person, but it is faster and easier and more relaxing with a couple lending on. This fish is one of the easiest and the most delicious way to do roast fish. It's nothing hard. Very simple and easy. Just gather your ingredients and the necessary thing to make your roast fish on the grill. However, some people may not like callaloo. You can use other stuffing. I will be doing the next video soon with different stuffings for your roast fish. For this video, we are using Kalalo and Okra, which is the main stuffings for roast fish. But you have other way you can do it. Now that all your fish is properly wrapped and ready to go on the grill, it's time to move on to the next process. Yes, yeah, so see, everything is filed and ready. So the next process, you will light your charcoal. You light the charcoal to, and get the grill at the right temperature. 
to start the roasting process. This roasting process is very simple. Just put fish on the grill, line the mountain, whatever formation you like. It won't make a difference in the roast same way. The other point of the fire is the center of the, the grill. So, during the roasting process, you will have to flip these fish several times to ensure they are not burned or anything like that. This roasting process is very easy. Don't worry, it's nothing hard. It's just about patience. So you will flip these fish from time to time, either in a 15 minute span or 10 minutes based upon the height, the heat and how high the flame is. Yeah, you can also rotate them, take from the other point put on. You can also use water to kind of cool the fire down. You realize these grill do not have anything to control the fire, so we normally use water. When the fish is come to a cook, you can space them around from the other point of the fire and add additional fish to continue the roasting process. To roast these fish, it's nothing hard. The only thing you need to know is when the fish roast. That is very simple. When you press on the file, your finger will sink in the fish. That simply means it is now cooked. That is all you know when the fish cook. Just pressing on it and it feels super squishy or soft. That means your fish is come to a cook. You can always have water to cool this fire down. The heat down because basically it's cooling the metal that the fish then. So it's like just low in the fire. The same thing. It will take some more time to bring back the heat up in the metal. So your fish is now roast. You just open file. This fish can eat as it is. People eat this fish with other thing, crackers, whatever they want. Universal as I always say. So you can just eat this as a meal or you can eat it with whatever you want. See? Tender, juicy, roast fish. Properly cooked. What more can you want? This is how easy it is to make roast fish nothing hard all you need to know is what ingredients to gather and associate with your fish you can see clearly this fish is properly cooked very delicious if you never eat roast fish before you will surely enjoy this as i say the stuffing is optional you can so also roast this fish without any stuffing it's optional so enjoy this fish family and friends drink a cup of beer drink water if you don't drink beer just enjoy as i always say if you think this video was educational or interesting please leave a like subscribe press the notification bell to see more video like this You know me there? More on top. How much a pound? Yeah. I give him a pound and a half now. Yeah. 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 Yeah.